Hi, this is Summer with Summer's Tips and Stitches. And, um, and Flynn. Okay, Flynn, do you want to say hi to our friends? Hi. Okay, did you want to say something particular to them, or should I get started on our video? Um, I was going to, like, announce this thing. It's going to be pretty embarrassing, but please do not dislike this video since, um... I just don't want it to be disliked, but, um... You gotta make sure you're in the video. If, if you can download this game called Roblox, um, join me in this game, or just friend me, and then join me in, in this game called Bird. <clears throat> and then, um, if you don't know my name in Roblox, um, it's Flinny Puncher. So, I'm um, right... Write down that um, on a piece of paper. Um, so so he, he he's inviting you guys to play birds with bird. him. Bird. All, Pardon me. All, bird. All capital. All capital. And on the, Roblox. And the um, creator is um, Jackson. For some reason, he misspelled Jack. And um, it was J C K. S O N. Oh. All right. So if you are interested in playing video games, Flynn is playing Bird. All right. Thanks, um, Flynn. Almost all the time. Almost all the time. I played it once, and I'm going to warn you. Sometimes other players take their birds, and they grab onto you, and they'll drag you around, and it's very frustrating. Yep, I've done that to a, a couple of people just to troll them. Me? Um, you did it to I me. Just, I just wanted to troll her. Um, please do not yell at me. It's fine. I'm not unhappy about it. It was just one troll. Just one time. He just did it one time. And I've done it to other people many times. Yeah. And don't yell at me for that. I won't. You can do that to as many other people as you'd like. Okay. All right. Well, I, thanks, Flynn. I was halfway in the video like this. I know. You're kind of like going in and out. All right. I'm going to talk about yarn now. Okay. Okay, so folks, I'm going to talk about yarn and now. I'm going to play Roblox. And Flynn's going to play Roblox. Probably Bird. Okay, so this is a yarn that they have at my Walmart. Um, I would pronounce it Heige, but it has um, a pronunciation underneath it of Huga. I don't know anything about this yarn. It's five ounces, 141 grams, 132 yards. It, um, if you want to make this specific knitted pattern here, you would need six skeins. It's made in Turkey. And um, this is called Cloud. It's a five bulky. Machine wash cold, gentle cycle, tumble dry, low. 70% acrylic, 30% nylon. <clears throat> We were at Walmart a couple weeks ago now, just when we got back from Boy Scout camp, and Jaron touched this yarn and was like, oh, I need it. So I told him I would make him a blanket. So this yarn is $5 and some change at Walmart. I don't remember the exact amount. I started making him this blanket. Let's hold it up this way. I'm making it a corner to corner, as you can see. Um, so I've got about this much here where I ran out and that was so six skeins of yarn. So I brought two more to kind of finish off the top of it and then maybe do a row of border. Um, the yarn is super soft and it's really easy to work with. I've not found that it catches on itself. You know how sometimes with a fuzzy yarn, if you go to pull out a stitch, it kind of like catches on it and you got to tug it and sometimes break it? That has not been occurring with this yarn. Um, I will say though, it does leave fuzzy bits. So when I was crocheting, I got some on my shirt. Um, I am kind of sad that my Walmart didn't have any more navy blue, but Jaron said he's fine with me finishing it off like this. And that's, that's a nice color combo. So that's currently one of my whips. I'm working on two projects actively, and that's the Shaded Color Shawl, Jer's Super Soft Blanket, and then I do have a couple backup projects that I've kind of like put away 
like that creature. I was making an Amigurumi creature out of Happy Ombre. I was making a Madeline sweater out of I Love This Yarn. Um, Jeanette sent me some blue I Love This Yarn. I think that's all that I have like working up right now. So I just thought I would share this with you. And then also this video is where I'm announcing my happy birthday giveaway. Of course, this is a surprise. Although you all knew it was coming, it's not in the title. I'm just gonna title it Yarn Chat and more. Um, so I've got together two bags. So they're not huge giveaways, friends. But I'm hoping, I think these mail for $7.43 in the United States. So we'll see. Now I will show you, they're for the most part identical. And you know, yeah, they are. They are identical. But I will show you anyway. I put in one Knitology skein. This is a glowing, uh, glowing worsted colorway flying trapeze. Over that over here. I also have two skeins or two hanks of this. This stuff is called Willow Brooks yarn. It's um, 206 yards, 50% super wash wool, 50% acrylic. I got this at Hershner's, and this is called Flamingo. So so far, three three hanks, and then. I'm including one of the hand dyed yarns I made. This is a pinkish purple mixture. This is um, superwash wool from Knit, Knit Crate. Um, I didn't name it, I hanked it. So, and I'm not 100% sure right now how many yards it is. I'll have to write that down. I also, my Walmart is selling these for like $288. So I bought a bunch of these. So I'm popping one of these in here. This one makes two dinosaurs. Then I also am including some Knitology or some Knit Crate patterns from Vesta and a Llama notebook. So let me tuck those back in and show you what's in the second one. As for value of this, I have no idea. Um, this is half of a knit crate, so that's 10. That other one I made, I don't know, maybe $5. 15, 18, I'd say about a 20 to $25 value. Um, I think that's part of the whole giveaway thing is you're supposed to say that. So that's one. And then I have another one. It's pretty much the same stuff. Glowing worsted trapeze, flying trapeze from knit crate. Two of these Willowbrook skeins of yarn that are half acrylic and half superwash wool. One of the hand dyed yarns I made. This one is a burger amigurumi. And then again, same things, uh, patterns in a notebook. Okay, you guys. So, um,. I am trying to think, let's see here. I would like to, I'm trying to figure out a good time to end this birthday giveaway, because this is the deal. My birthday is the 18th. I'm hoping to go away, to go on a little overnight, the 17th and the 18th. And the 19th is a teacher in service. So I'll have the giveaway end on August 19th, even though my birthday is August 18th. And there's one of you out there that put in the, and I want to say Marie, Maria, maybe, that has the same birthday as me. Um, anyway, so we're going to have this end on August 19th. And on August 20th, sometime during that day, you guys, I can't give you an exact time. I will, I'll do one of those generic um, videos where you just see the random comment picker. Choose two folks um, to get a birthday present from me. Um, then it's the same kind of things. I'm going to put in the description. I'm going to list the rules. Um, then also I'm going to just remind you if you live in one of those countries that can't receive mail from us, please don't enter. Also, um, 
just also this is not sponsored by YouTube. This is not sponsored by any yarn companies. This is sponsored by me and Vesta because she donated all those uh, patterns. And I'm telling you guys, I've made some of those knit crate patterns and they're awesome. So you'll like that. And then um, let's see here. I think that's all that I have to say about the, the giveaway information. Now, in the comments below, how about you just say, you know, happy birthday. That, if you post in there, nope. Yeah, just go ahead. Just post happy birthday, Summer. That way I know you read the rules, you agree, and you are someone who's wanting to get a birthday present. There's going to be two. And I think that's going to wrap up my summer giveaways because I think I've done like three or four others already. And um, yeah, so that's that. So that is this video. That was all. Really, this video was mostly about getting that giveaway together. But then I also wanted to tell you guys that this I was using this yarn. This is new this summer to my Walmart. And so I really, um, I hopefully will have this finished in the next day or two for Jer. And the shaded color shawl is like 80% done. Somebody just grabbed Flynn's bird and drug him off a cliff. Nope, that didn't happen. I oh. just um, magically died by something. He magically died, sorry. He's getting upset with his game. But that is all, you guys. That is what this video is about. I'm talking about this uh, high gee, huga. It can't be English. This cannot be English if they wanted to say huga. It's got to be a different language. I don't know what. Maybe I'll do some research. And then I have my birthday present. Remember, if you want to enter, you need to tell me happy birthday in the bottom of it. That's it. And the contest, this uh, giveaway ends on August 19th. And I'll put the video out on August 20th. And that's it. Thanks for liking and subscribing. Thanks for sharing my vid videos and for watching. Um, that's it. Until then, happy crafting. Bye. Bye.